millions of genetically modified mosquitoes are set to be released in California and Florida to reduce the number of disease-carrying mosquitoes. The Environmental Protection Agency on Monday approved the plan to further test the modified insects. The mosquitoes were created by UK-based biotechnology firm Oxitec, which is funded by the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, in an attempt to prevent insect-borne diseases such as dengue fever, yellow fever, and the Zika virus. The genetically modified male mosquitoes, which do not bite, will be released into the wild where they are expected to mate with females to pass on a lethal gene that will effectively ensure their offspring die before being maturity. Millions of the mosquitoes were released in the Florida Keys last year in a test project, and the EPA has authorized the extension of the project in Florida and four counties in California, pending approval from the state's regulators. However, there have been concerns about what impacts releasing the mosquitoes could have on public health as well as the environment. Dana Pearls, Food and Technology Program Manager with Friends of the Earth, an environmental advocacy organization, told USA Today, this is a destructive move that is dangerous for public health. Once you release these mosquitoes into the environment, you cannot recall them, she said. J.D. Hansen, policy director with the Center for Food Safety, said that the experiment is unnecessary and even dangerous. There are no locally acquired cases of dengue, yellow fever, chikungunya, or Zika in California, Hansen said. According to courts, areas including Malaysia, Brazil, the Cayman Islands, and Panama have seen their mosquito populations reduce as much as 90% after similar experiments.